It is nothing new to hear teenagers testing their limits, but now, instead of just underage drinking, many teens are turning to prescription pills. Substance abuse experts say there is a rise in teens using pills straight from their parents' medicine cabinets at house parties. 23 ABC's Leslie Marine is here to tell us more. Leslie? These parties are known as farm parties. Although they are nothing new to many people, I spoke to a local substance abuse counselor who told me more and more kids are attending these parties. Pharmaceutical parties or farm parties, they're the latest craze for kids looking to get high these days. Yeah, there's all kinds of stuff there. You know, you don't know what to expect when you go into an environment like that. Teens raid their parents' medicine cabinets for prescription pills. Once at the party, everyone drops their pills into a bowl, and every 20 minutes, they take a pill, flushing it down with alcohol. Beer, a lot of weed, uh, a lot of beer pong, people, you know, popping pills. Kevin Bravo says there are farm parties around Bakersfield. He says although he's never attended, the things he's heard aren't good. People usually get taken advantage. They usually drug them. A lot of, you know, there's people be, you know, smoking out the houses. According to Ellen Egger, a substance abuse counselor who speaks at schools around the city, more and more kids are coming up to her talking about these parties. They tell me what happens at them. Um, and I've been to a lot of the schools in town, and they, they are happening. Um, it's scary. She says that although there have not been any deaths reported in Kern County, the result of a night like this can be deadly. The kids um, that have come up to me and I, who have talked to me about it, um, they have seen kids pass out, and they never know, should we call the police, should we not? Um, and thank God no one, that, that the kids that I have talked to, no one has died but it, it could happen. Eggert says the best way to stop this from happening to your child is to communicate. They're going to try it because it's, it's something there. So, you know, being open with your kids and allowing them to talk about whatever. According to the partnership at DrugFree.org, as many as one in five teens say they have taken pills without a prescription. For 23ABC, I'm Leslie Marine.